I want to begin just by putting in context this conversation that we're having today. If you and I went downtown and somebody started hurting my daughter, we would both immediately respond and stop him and do whatever it would take to help her. Because after all, my daughter Waverly is only six and she doesn't deserve to be treated like that. And if we walked a little bit further and we saw somebody else hurting a little boy, we would rush that abuser and immediately help that little boy. But somehow, if that abuse happens in a zip code or a family that's far removed from our own world, too many people view that as government's problem alone. And that that's a sad situation that they feel almost powerless to help. I'm pleased that each of you clearly understand the plight of kids who are abused and neglected and why we're all here today. It's not a faceless problem. It's a personal priority. And just like all of you, at our own think tank, we read regularly of the tragedies of the foster care system and various reform ideas to improve the system on behalf of kids and families. 